Is there like a mystery to fasting that if I learn it, I'll actually come into union and transformation with Christ? Well, let's see. Join us today as we look at fasting. Hi, I'm Brian Fenimore, the founder and director of Plumline Ministry. We want to be like Jesus so that we see transformation in our relationships, our families, and our lives. Thanks for joining us today. Well, we're working through the topic of fasting, and what we're going to do today is we're going to look at a statement that's made to us in 2 Corinthians chapter 4, verse 16, and it says this, Though our outward is wasting away, yet our inward is being renewed day by day. So what are the benefits of fasting? Now remember, fasting is letting go of the system of the world, either through food or media or time, and embracing the kingdom of God so that transformation can happen. And one of the ways that Jesus says this actually happens is through fasting. And he uses here in this passage in 2 Corinthians the idea of being renewed. So why do I need, the word renewed is really interesting because it literally means newness is touching you on a consistent basis or you're being rejuvenated. So even though we know this in reality, here my physical body is getting older and it's decaying as time goes on, yet when I touch into God, since he's life-giving, renewal can actually come to my soul and I can be quickened and transformed, healed, or whatever the kingdom of God is doing. Now, is that beneficial for you and I? Absolutely. I find a lot of people, myself included, that when we go through struggles, there's a sense of diminishment going on inside of our thinking or diminishment or weakness inside our soul or our emotions. And yet, fasting brings us back to that newness of when we met the Lord, we felt His power and His strength. And it's like we cut into a river or a current of life that is so vital for us as we live in a fallen world. Now, Jesus has called you and I to this. He wants you transformed by fasting. The question is, will you come into this? I encourage you to do that. Now, thanks for joining us today. We'll see you next time, and bless you. Please consider to become a partner of Plumline. Go to our website and sign up today so that Plumline can move forward with the message that the Lord has given us. Our goal is to become like Jesus so that we can see transformation in our relationships, our family, and the work that God has given us. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you next time.